Hello, I'm Rob. And I'm Megan. Thank you for taking a look at our Parent Finder video. We hope that you and your baby are both feeling good and that things are going well. Come on inside. Rob and I have been married for almost seven years, and for most of that time we lived a few hours from here. But we recently moved back to my hometown, where we're close to my family, and I've been able to renew old friendships. We've built a few new friendships, and we're a lot closer to Rob's family as well. Megan and I have a lot of nieces and nephews, 13 and counting, and our families can't wait for the next edition. Any child that we adopt will have a big group of kids to play with at family events. I am an art teacher at a local middle school. I enjoy creating new projects for the kids and teaching them new techniques. We recently completed a mural at the school where I teach, and that was a lot of fun. I sing in church choir, and I help with the children's choir. I babysit for a couple kids that belong to some friends of mine. We have a lot of fun playing in the sandbox and going to the park, having picnics outside. Um, also, for five years, I helped to coach the boys and girls rugby team, and the girls this year had their best season yet, which was really fun to see. A big change in my life right now is my new job. I recently started working as the principal of a local elementary school. It's a lot of work, but it's also fun to watch the students grow and enjoy their learning. I was an art teacher for 15 years before becoming a principal, and I still teach a class from time to time. I also recently coached a high school baseball team. It was fun to reconnect with my playing days and work with some talented young athletes. I also like doing yard work and bird watching. This is just a small sampling of the family that we are surrounded by who just can't wait to support us in this journey. We have some amazing role models as parents in our own parents and our sisters and brothers and their families and we just can't wait to be a part of that mix. Both of our families are great at keeping traditions alive. Megan and I get together often with our parents and siblings and our nieces and nephews. We have big family gatherings at Easter, Christmas, Thanksgiving, and Fourth of July as well as smaller gatherings throughout the year. Megan's parents live close and they come over often for dinner and games of cards. Here's a picture of a great group of friends that we try to get together with each year and they're beautiful kids, some of whom have been adopted into their families. We live in a great neighborhood to raise a family. We have a big corner lot in a safe and quiet part of town. There's lots of children nearby who like to play outside. There's an elementary school within walking distance. There are great parks and playgrounds nearby, and there's a university, the one that I attended, which is also nearby, so we can go on nice walks through campus. Rob and I enjoy doing projects together. We've renovated several homes, including the one we live in now. We just love looking at a space and finding a way to make it new and improved and fresh. We want to adopt for a very simple reason. We've not been blessed with children of our own, and we think we'd be excellent parents. We are well educated. We both have jobs in great schools. We live in a house and a neighborhood that are kid friendly. And we have a large extended family who can't wait to support us and our child after the adoption. In fact, my own sister is videotaping this for us today and she's offered great encouragement to us as well. In my work as a principal, I routinely get to interact with kids. I love watching them grow and learn. Megan regularly babysits for a four-year-old and a seven-year-old. She loves taking them to karate, gymnastics, and baseball, as well as reading books to them and doing art projects. And those kids adore her. We'd like for this adoption to be as open as you're comfortable with. We'll send cards, pictures, and letters, or if you'd rather, we'll schedule times to get together and, and just spend time. Thanks again for taking some time to get to know us. We know that you're going through a lot right now, and we appreciate that you're choosing life for your baby. Placing a child in an adoptive home takes a lot of guts. Your baby is lucky to have a mother like you. Thank you.